This is Destiny Matters. Every man is born for a particular purpose, and it's God's pleasure to help you become it. Welcome to Destiny Matters. And now, your host, author, pastor, and speaker, Charles Casivante. Very good uh, evening. Welcome to Destiny Matters. You're watching Rest TV. I'm glad to be able to speak to you again. We thank God for His goodness and mercy that truly endures forever. I want to remind you that we are sponsored by Interior Center for Mwakaliga uh, for the best furniture. Please visit them. Today we are shooting this uh, telecast from uh, the, the good environment of Kansanga Miracle Center. <laughs> a, a very beautiful place. And uh, of course, Pastor Isaac Chiwewe is our father in the spirit. A man of excellency, such beauty, such glamour, uh, in beauty, surely showing the glory of the Lord. To all the women that are watching today, happy Women's Day. This is going to be a special telecast te targeted women. It will change your life. I am very pleased and excited to host a, a woman who has been at the helm of, of, of gender, uh, in, in this nation, talking to women, women empowerment, women, women in the rural areas. She's been in the corporate uh, ladder for a long time, and I'm super excited that we are going to be hosting her today on Destiny Matters. But, but welcome somebody, make sure that somebody is with us today and uh, be a part of what is going on. Owangi gwe soko ulide vina ofe aba interior center wa sangi wa endatete kwa kariga road. Toko tu siriza sofa set ya zomu lembe dining tables, center tables wardrobes, ebitanda entele ze mikolo ya zomu lembe sideboards, emifoliso ebimuli ebiru unji, sakoni katenzi, eziriko. Atete tukomi ya ofe aba interior center fewa kafuru mkukolila gipsum ceiling tuzimbe biyongo, wardrobe partitions, sakoni tv stands Munyumba yo, orunu ni shanana. Tuwesige, tukukoli na ichi omlembe. Tukubileko, kuzilo msavu tanu munana, nkaga mumuenda, msavu mubiri, ana musatu. Oba, kunoti msavu msavu bili, ana musatu, ana mumusavu, ama kumia satu. Faba idili ya senta, tuwesige, tunja kwenjusa. I'd like to bless the Lord for every one of you that partners with me, that is supporting what God has put upon my life. I would like to ask you kindly concerning this wonderful project that you see on the screen. And we're going to believe God to raise and build that thing for the kingdom of God here in the Mutundwe area. And you, your support, your giving is really important. Some of you are asking, Pastor, how can I give? There, there's a number on the screen, call now. Or you can just send your seed on those numbers and say, Pastor, I want to be a part of what you're doing. Thank you for serving God. In our generation, God wants us to build some things. The next generation is going to look up to and look at our God and see what God has done through ours. And But above all things, I want you to be a part of the blessing. You see, there's nothing as powerful as taking your resources and giving them into the kingdom that the kingdom may be built. Many of you can stand with me right now. I want to mind the Zikis and Musolo Pimiranang, Musongeno, to Solokus and Boba Kabaka Katonda, to a compass and easy. As in Tunuzoina, the way is in Sikoyo, who garment is was a Kuzimba, when na. Vinana Joe, you know, never will go to Munafu, or Ganzaman Gang Sivant, Colacho Solo Cola, or Mukisabuja Kuja Mayumba Gamu, among which is in the Chenum Kamatia Zimba, when Mulia Mayumba Gamu, the Mulia Maganda Gamu, the Muli Factory Samway, the Muli Zimbi Yamwe, Jagalo Sigan Sik of Munia Mukama, we made a no Muli Muguno to turn the project channel very, very soon. Casatumari is of Kulava Centers on Azuese, when a Kujizi Musa, Maninta Uli Chundu Kucho, Katunda, Kole, we could name Yama. So, Uncle Gaili de Mukama, you get now, we can soon gain. You can't have him never to love and never to read this. She can't put him put it at a partner in an angle into a category of Kuani Savinji, Mokenda Kuangula. Utah over the Raman in a Mukama Kuanguza. I gamble your Kobunam Kama to one again the Katona Navantu, Nayomazino Angula. It was twenty years of struggle. The man struggled, but at the end of the day, he prevailed. I pray you shall prevail. May the Lord open supernatural doors for you and cause you to prevail. I'm looking forward for you to support. Stand with me now as you do it on those numbers. There's also an equity bank account. You can send in your seed on that equity bank account right now and be a, a big blessing.
blessing to the destiny matters and to house of expression church god bless you thank you for standing with me i'm looking forward to seeing the glory of the lord touching your families your children in amazing ways you touching your spouse elevating you and lifting up your head in this season to the glory of the name of jesus because we pray somebody said amen god bless you i'll see you another time welcome again this is destiny matters very, very glad that we, we are able to connect with all of you that are joining again. God has been good. The, oh, my, oh my God, the year is running too fast. We are already in the month of March. <laughs> uh, I just want to welcome all the women that are joining us today on Rest TV. This is going to be a special telecast designed for you, ladies, women, young women, older women. Don't touch the dial. You're welcome to Destiny Matters. We are proudly sponsored and brought to you by Interior Center. Inter Interior Center for the best furniture. It is found in Unatete, Wakariga. Join, uh, go there, visit, and you will be mightily, mightily blessed. Today on set, um, I'm going to be talking to uh, a lady, a, a woman who has been in the corporate realms, a Christian, God-fearing woman, but also being able to walk the tides of the corporate world, which is not very, very easy and uh, internationally, by the way. We are very pleased, we are very glad today and privileged to have with us Dr. Taupista Sechito Ntali. I didn't know the Ntali name, by the way. <laughs> That's my father's name. Yeah, but we are, <laughs> We can't talk about that. But, <laughs> but we are glad to have uh, Dr. Teopista. She's a specialist in finance and gender, and currently the Africa Ambassador of, in Financial Alliance for Women, and also the country director for New Faces, New Voices. Uh, a program that is under Glacier Marshall Trust. Uh, of course, many of you have known uh, Dr. Teo through the bank banking system for many mm. years, mm. Uh, sometimes also into media. Yes. She was also at, at some <laughs> point working in media. But we are glad to have you. <laughs> thank you. And thank you for sparing your, uh, <laughs> uh, your very good time. Mm. Uh, I'm, 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 I've, I've been watching you for a long time doing what you do. We are happy to have you on REST TV. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you for inviting me. Thank you for welcoming me. Uh, but I feel at home because this is my church. Exactly. And this is my father's house. So yeah. it's, it's a good feeling. Yeah. So, and how long have you been at Kansang? Almost 50, 20, 15 uh, years? Almost uh, 21 years, yeah. Wow. From the time before we had this church, when we still had the little church. And, that, and, and at that time... You have grown up, were you still working in the bank? What were you doing? Yes, at, at I was time? still working in the bank. Yeah. I joined here when I was still working at Standard Chartered Bank. Yeah, yeah. Wow. then I went to DFC Bank. Yeah. And uh, most of the prophetic works that, uh, words that worked for me came from here. Yeah. So I clung on to them. Even when I, I wanted to resign, I first came to report to the headquarters yeah. and asked Papa, Papa, what do you think? He said, yeah, it's time up. So I went and wow. raised. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, but it's a story for all of us. Pastor mm -hmm. Tuesday has been a mighty blessing in mm -hmm. our lives. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah. Uh, Dr. Teo, mm -hmm. first of all, Uganda again in a Jacujaguza Women's Day. Mm. Milestone is the Mulabie, Gamuli Mugenda. Uh, why were they went to Kachuka since maybe you know, probably after the government, this government came in, into power? Mm. There's been a, a lot of women emancipation and empowerment. Has there been strides? Do you see progress? Is there more work to be done? Okay, uh, Otandi Kidde Wakati, Otandi Kid Wakati, Katsoket Abachara, but Rabo Rado. International Women's Day in a background. So many years ago, yeah. so different women from different parts of the world started fighting what they thought was injustice. But in Uganda, the first International Women's Day for Uganda was celebrated in, in uh, 1984, which was a little bit late compared to yeah, other, other, other parts of the world. And so many different interventions. Eh? Also, that means way before even this government came in power. Yeah, 1984, yes, at State House. Yeah. That was the first, yeah, it was 8th March, yes, yeah. 1984. That was the first time the, the country, the people, the state, the government came together to say, we are celebrating International Women's Day. What's the background? I mean, what's, what's, what's the birth internationally? Who, 
like which which country budget who brought it up is it a UN thing? yeah yeah it's more of the I think because of racism and because of you know racial segregation the the engine that started it was more in the America, okay, America. Yeah. Yeah. yeah because here yeah, by by that time the, because of exposure and because of the social construction mm -hmm. the 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 way the system had set its its divisions between men and women was more of a culture founded, yeah. yeah. And people were struggling to keep that intact. I can imagine, I, I can imagine, do Arab countries also celebrate Women's Day? Have they, have yes, they received it? Definitely. The world is now becoming a one sport. Yeah. Yeah. Even when you don't see it physically, internally, because of the the ignition and the exposure yeah. and the you know the ex traveling attending different uh, meetings some uh, arab countries have started letting loose yeah. Yeah, some of these uh, uh, practices yeah. because i think culturally uh, women struggle in, in those well i don't know, i don't know if they know maybe they have embraced <coughs> it that mm. this is who we are and all that yeah i think uh, some of the countries have mixed religion and culture. And, and, and culture then uh, mixed it with gender rights and empowerment. Yeah. Yeah. So m in most cases, human beings construct environment to fit what benefits them. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. I mean, yeah. And, 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 and of course, in Uganda, I think there's been a lot of stride. Yes. Yeah. And those are Omuchala, 1984, mm. 2024. Mm. Of course, when in 1995, when government made it intentional yeah. through the legislation to make it uh, to prioritize mm. certain interventions, then Uganda as a world changed yeah. because it was now starting from the most important component, which is parliament and the legislature. Yeah. yeah, you can't implement something unless it is backed up. Uh, by government or at a certain level yeah, and, and it is cascaded down to consumers and or beneficiaries or police or something yes, like that, yeah. Yeah. so what would you note as registered progress for I want us to, to look at this woman who is in 1984 mm. in, in Uganda at that time and a woman who is now operating in 2024 at, 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 at a general scale is, is there been progress do you are there visible things you can say this has been attained uh, even this alone me being here as a woman uh, yeah. before when you looked at the ratio even of people who had access yeah or people who would yeah. be accepted that alone you know the ratio was maybe 80 to 10 but now we can even have 50 to 50 yeah. we have very strong vocal people like when our numbers in the late Cecil Ogwa rest in peace people who have stood up but because yeah, the environment yeah. is conducive yeah, yeah. and because the government has allowed it to happen, but also, and I want people here to, to note this, because more girls are getting educated. When you're educated, yeah. you are empowered with a lot of self-worth. And that's where it all begins. Yeah. When you talk about empowerment, it starts with self-worth, the capacity to make decisions that are for you, you yeah. know, the capacity to, 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 to make decisions for social change for people around you. I can stand now and make a decision around my children's education. Yeah. I can stand and contribute to uh, you know, the agenda for, uh, for the communities where I live. Yeah. So all that has been handled you know, in, in, in a framework that yeah. contributes to I, the success. And, and also I also think the previous notion the gender was the Mondoza and get to know about and the Catavalo Kubanga. There are more women in any population than men, yes, of course. Kati, when women are not part of the policies, mm. and uh, I think also you see that when things are built without women participating, mm. it becomes a man's world, it becomes a man's world, like because the ones who are uh, you, you know creating that world and not thinking about. They, they have no lenses of women mm. and then they create that world to be fed in by children and, and women who are actually more than the men yeah but yeah. Uh, pastor what you have to know and people who are watching um it's a natural phenomenon that in every man yeah there is another command 
Which command that is, is that the, the man <laughs> that that yeah muluganda bakaita kasajja even if a man is huge inside Boy. that Overboy. yeah no mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, there is uh, there is uh, uh, another <laughs> man <laughs> in in luganda uh, it is akamango eh akantu ako nti nebobeeranga omuchala ye breadwinner era bwajeka ayagala abantu abamwetorodo babana balo balo woze oba omuchala agambe nti ye yakoze kino yes yeah and i've seen people um oline yegulire motoka na ye na posting ak social media tena yo yatujira nti thank you to my husband nga no msaja tamanyi na motoka je yavude so we are we even in this stand era we are still struggling with that mbaja ndaka onyonya bunja kasaja are you talking about ego like 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 a man's ego boyo gela ku in the interpretation is is different not that ever nugu uh, muluzungu bachita massaging that inside part kuba omuntu abera ne morphological outlook nayo omuntu yenyini andro oba mwami kasibante ali ali munda fete tusobola mulaba kati tumulabira kunjogera ye kunyamba la ye kuneyisa ye ku answers olumu zawa in a given environment yeah. Yes, kati abantu bonna katonda buli muntu katonda ya mwaula. There are people who are kind, there are people who are generous, there are people who but yeah. there are people who are hard. And most men whether poor, rich, educated, they have that hardened uh, unseen person yeah. that has to be kept in check. Na yo manyo also I think also it is um, it's, it's, it's maybe psychology of our our cultural environments. Even at birth, mm. there's a certain reception mm. yes. for a girl child with a, with a, with a, as if the boy must succeed, must, it must be an addition, mm. and the girl normally is not. Mindset here, you. But do you see that changing over the years? Kati, about why no kumanyanti. Even to every movie, I described being important. It's so like Malaga Vijao, Kubanka. Let me just take an example. Boza Roman or Mola, so okay, like Machana Fumbidwa, or Muntu Jaza de Chechka. Yeah. Yeah. Whereas in places like South Africa, Mona Aquatachka, Cha Cha Mama, Eda Namania. Kati, Evia, yes. Kati, even to every movie, we are reconstructed by our great 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 parents, and somehow. We have to dance to their music mm. at a certain level. Mm. However, ngapo na gambi choko soma katia ba na ba noeva na agenda ba soma. Tula bi katia abasajja nga umwa na umwalo ba ba na ba ba wala ba focusing zeko in areas of taking over, especially people who have built empires. Yeah. But remember, nebo wa muleke rango umwala nti ataking charge of um, the empire. Na ya to kumuskira. Era mu culture era ja kuba mulenzi kulwachi kubanga omwana omulenzi bwanaza bwanaza alaba na bajja ku inheritinga linyalyo nti kasibante nga oli ku fourth generation lenga be bachi ali bakasibante so echo techigenda kuva wakati nedda yeah so economic inheritance and the, the the social inheritance are two different things so so what are you doing when you are empowering women mubaba mukolachi era mukola bichebe bibe yeah, first of all, I want to uh, to thank our partners, you know, UN Women Finance Trust Bank, yeah. URA Casita, and uh, of late, for the last two years, uh, Bill and Melinda Gates and the Visa Foundation. Uh, first of all, yes, we are currently running a program uh, funded by him. Okay. Yes, and we visa. Vi yes, and visa foundation, but okay. it came through our head office in South Africa, so it's currently uh, being implemented in about fourteen African countries, yeah. and Uganda being one of the beneficiaries. Yeah. Uh, what What people have to know, uh, we will start from the neighborhood. Yeah. Just here at church, if you are where we are, when your neighbors are still struggling with food then you are the person who is at a disadvantage. Yeah. You have something to lose, they don't. So what we are trying to do in the women economic space is to make sure that we carry along as big a number of women 
to be in position to make choices. There is nothing as bad in this world as not being able to make a choice for yeah, yourself. Yeah. yeah. When you can't make a choice, then you are dancing to the tune or to the music of another individual. And the theme for this year is around economic empowerment. What we have uh, researched, and this is scientifically proven, if you are economically empowered, there are so many things that fall suit, even rights, even, you know, the ability to raise responsible children, the ability to give them the best education. So we are saying, let's carry as many women as possible with us so that the world will leave our children will be a better place. That is basically the principle. Yeah. yeah. And that's really, 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 very, very important. Mm. So I'll, I'll ask you in, in the next segment, mm. the thin line between empowerment and feminism, because mm. I think that is very, very key also. Mm. Mm. I mean, I mean, look at our government, mm. vice president, mm. prime minister, a speaker, mm. almost the first few positions of, of, of government mm. are mothers, are women. Uh, because here at Recipe, by the way, our theme for, the, for uh, Women's Day is mm. uh, Is there a strike? How do people balance, if that word exists, how do people balance between being a mother? I have got to raise my children, mm. but I also have got to work. Mm. I have to put food on the table. Why not? Because we are going to have a children. Um, we are going to have which means that there are so many single mothers. Yeah. Now, you are balancing at your raising of Anna. I think of our color. I think in the end of the day, we are going to have a child. Yeah. I think for people who are watching, we are going to have a child. We are going to have a child. Most of the issues that we are facing. A foundational yeah. best. Yeah. Yeah? Musinji. Yeah, Musinji. So if mm. certain things are done right, you know, right from the family level, yeah. and then people make correct choices, your statement is Jagende Kendera. Yes, because if you find out Ruachab and Tubagamba and Zetat and Zemama, one, poorly brought up children. Mm. And most of those children have certain foundations. Mm. Yeah. yeah? with due respect to our brothers and sisters in other religions. I was looking at the statistics of uh, the percentage of abana kati abatambula. People know I'm always on the plane, literally. Abana abatambula abagenda. You'll find that out of every 10, abagenda okola, yeah, sagala chi itabudu, but that's what it is. Ojakusanga, the biggest portion of those children by in a background of a certain religion. So we go back to the foundation. They have grown up in an environment where they have to prove to people around them, maybe stepmothers, maybe, you know, people around them that they are worth. Yeah. That now becomes an emotional problem you are dealing with. A telephys country, Yajirava. So, Bakuzeba Bagamba, you are nothing, you will be nothing, you know. No, so Makwe, Rumune, Kubera terminated in the middle. But in space where they don't feel safe. So, as a church, as a country, as a people, people have to remember one thing that the decisions you make as a parent mm -hmm. will affect the children and another generation. We are now having people waking up to realize that, no, this is how I, how I grew up. I don't want my children to be in the same fracas. Yeah, yeah so that foundation thing and mm -hmm. lack of so you worthiness. Think has also played a very big role. Of course, people know it. Yeah. 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 You can't honestly take care of what every child. No. There's a man I saw the other day on TV has uh, 70 children. Yeah. yeah. 70. Zero. And, and like, the, and the like, society still think yeah. he's man enough when he's in a grass thatched house in the 21st century. And having the highest person go up to P6 in you this saw that down also, era. I know. Yes, I saw it. So you see, when society constructs yeah, certain, yeah, certain yeah. ailments wrongly. Yeah. So, and how do you deal with that? Uh, culture changes because I believe that one of the hardest things that we we face in Africa mm. is to change culture how we think mindset you know, what do you do to help the women change how because well, we'll, uh, you know, 
Yeah, uh, I want people to do a research because what I'm talking about, I, I witnessed. I, yeah. uh, the people who know, I worked in Malaysia. When I was in Standard Chartered Bank, they posted me in Malaysia for some time. Malaysia is 99% Muslim. Yeah. But I never interacted with anyone who had two wives. So I took it upon myself to find out why. And one of the professors, Yusuf, who was uh, accommodating me, had three daughters. And he was so happy, he told me, uh, when Africa is interpreting some of these things, they stop somewhere. They don't go deep to understand what other uh, things you have to do before you move to a second, yeah. a, a second, um, a second wife. wife. For instance, the woman, the first wife, has to participate in the recruitment of the co-wife. Yeah, yeah. Uh, the Muslim people listening <laughs> know that. But also financially, yeah. you should be stable. That's why we have the mama and the tata. Because you are struggling, yeah. maybe earning 20,000, you're a border rider. This person coming to you knows that you already have six children. Yeah. That's what we say in Uganda. What we know, aliku steering. Naliku kameme. So, naya fuse expenditure. So, bo guam emoto kabo guamu chini. Aliku kameme ya soko kuva kona agua. So those are the children now yeah. about becoming yeah. anzema manze tata. At each single kunumanti, a lot of people ha have shattered dreams. Nayenga dreams that are shattered by the decisions you took. As a father or as a mother? Mm. Yes. Na sango mvubuka vuga boda. Na ye ubula mbubu na yari agala nyoku vera doctor. Na ye, bwebaso mabibali bali mu S2. Tebeleza S2 nga ya singa ye. He comes from Mbali. Tata wena abagamba wa uluzungu we muso miyeko lumala. Nino, nino kusituraba na abato. You see, that is a decision that shattered. His dream. Yeah. Chovula banga, walabie ngono muami gwebase. Nula babana haba participate in the very young kids. Mm. But I was talking to somebody to try and find out for me, and I have already confirmed one of them was raised in that environment of competition. There is not enough space for him to express himself. He has to prove at all times that he's strong. You know his worth. <clears throat> yeah. Mm. I think I think I think you bring out a very very important important key, which is education. Yes. Yeah. And also, yeah. But also. Um, there's been a, a discussion in, the, in, in this nation about, and you, you being, you know, some of the people that are, you know, in our society that you know think of these things. I would like to ask you what you think about our education system. Have you have you, have you thought about it? Do you think it is, uh, it is helping? Is it kugamba? Or mutwa banga asume ebintu bitwa asuma anga mo nineteen hundred. I mean, mo kumi ruenda chenda nekakati. Is it really going to take this nation to, to the next level or there has to be a change? I think what uh, African governments have not done is rebelling against colonialism and its trickle-down effects. Yeah. So the, the, the education system, Yetulina, was designed by colonialists that wanted to create more of color, white collar people yeah. who are job seekers as opposed to creators. Yes, yes. That is basically the summary. That's why you'll have people celebrating, you know, you have 12,000 people have done BCOM, what? But at the end of the day, you'll find them uh, in the market selling tomatoes. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm, I'm grateful to the government. They, they, there is now something being done around, changes, yeah. Yeah, around changes. But also, it is important to allow experts to play in the space. Yeah. You know, African governments have to appreciate that they are people that have mastered certain areas yeah. and they can be more beneficial if they are allowed to play in that space yeah. whether in the in the in, a, in health or whether in education there are things i mean you can't be a pilot if, if, you can't course. operate somebody on the table so the same way those uh th those professions are being taken should be the same way these other spaces are yeah. respected yeah i think we should allow Professionals, a professionals, yes. Who've mastered areas, yes. To come to, in and be and be part. To be in charge. Ante we have fuzi, baba, oya kudia yo guamani and all that stuff. Na yo oyoke de kusonga, ya polygamy, mobu silam. Even me, uh, recently, I, I was in Canada and mm. a cab driver mm. is a Muslim man. Ngatunyumia. Nanga manti in the Muslim faith, there mm. is nothing like. Uh, 
it's not mandatory to marry. No, it's not. A second wife, no. third wife. No. Ningaba abafa baduga vuba bijjawa. Oba olina ga ntino bwe bajjawa no. Okubaga zo busiramu. Well, okubaga ze din. Chiba chiba akola. Baba baba gamba ye bintu bibaga ze din. Nge chimu kuchonto so kwa so mukazo wo kuna no okumeka. But I don't think it has really gone down well. Abachi bagamba bali ba many long term damage. Yeah. There are some people who have handled it well, they are especially people who are economically well off, yeah. and they have provided and who have seen the children come out. But in life, but it's, it's not. It's not. Life is not just about money and a beautiful house. Yeah. Life is about a child waking up and knows that in in a home there is a chain of command, a hierarchy, yeah. and we have seen once that is distorted. Even the whole brain distorts. Yeah. When Bani Nature to change Agalabana Banga Bakole, Mbagamba, that did not yachi in Giram because naturally Katona is constructing a watu. Abana and Gedeva to Alam Mamma, Sijeva to Alam Tata. There is a power, there is that power that lies within manhood as opposed to womanhood. Yeah, yeah. you're watching <laughs> Rest TV and Destiny Matters. I'm here with uh, Dr. D Dr. Teo P. Star. To <laughs> that entire name we are about to we'll, we'll talk about it. <laughs> when when we come back from the break, I want to ask her questions around areas of feminism and also parenting. She has been able to, to, to raise good young men. I want to know the secret why. <laughs> but as we come back, you're watching Destiny Matters West TV. It's a special edition on women. Stay tuned for more when we come back. Wangi kwe soko ulide bina ofe Aba interior center wa sengi wa enatete kwa kariga road Tukutu siriza sofa set ya zomu lembe Dining tables, center tables, wardrobes, ebitanda Entele ze mikolo ya zomu lembe Sideboards, emifaliso Ebimuli ebiru unji Sakoni katenzi, eziriko Atete tukomia ofe Aba interior center Fewa kafuru mkukoli la gipsum ceiling Tuzi mbebi yongo Woodrow partitions Sakoni TV stands mnyumba yo Olunu ni ishana na Tuwesige, tukukoli na ichi omu lembe Tukubileko, kuzira msambu tanu munana Nkaga mumuenda, nsambu mubiri Ana musatu, oba Kunoti msambu msambu bidi Ana musatu, ana mumusambu Ama kumia satu, faba idili ya senta Tuwesige, tunja kujusa This is Destiny Matters. Every man is born for a particular purpose And it's God's pleasure to help you become it Welcome to Destiny Matters. And now, your host, author, pastor, and speaker, Charles Casivante. Welcome back. This is Red TV, and you're watching Destiny Matters. Of course, we are sponsored by Interior Center. Thank you uh, for joining us to today on this special edition of um, Women's Day celebrations that are going to be happening here in Uganda. I'm told the government celebrations are in Katakui. Yeah. The theme is the empowering of women, uh, mm. investing in women, the inter international theme. Yes. Our theme here at Press TV is uh, uh, the hardworking woman, Omukazo Omukozi. Omukazo Omukozi. Omukazo Omukozi. Kumanga, window, teba nene nyomu kama jatu gulia. Talk about empowerment, talk self-worth. I like, I love that. Mm. Empowerment means self, knowing yeah. your self worth. When you say I'm empowered, yeah. it means you have reached at a level where you know your self worth, yeah. and there are things you can take on, there are things you can stand and say no to. So where is the line? <laughs> where, where, where is the line between knowing my self worth <laughs> and knowing submission when it comes to marriage? Uh, and and probably do people dive into feminism? That move that want to say. Uh, Women, for our children to be married, to be able 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 to be to it yeah, grows yeah, over a period. Yeah, yeah. So the first, the first environment that plays that role is the family where you were born yeah. and the people around you. Oh. 
Mm. The schools you go yeah, to, yeah. the people who become your friends, the kind of man you marry, the kind of background of the man, then where you work. So it's a whole uh, environment. Yeah. And people have to always watch out in that environment. That's why right now, to be an amassment, we're going to be in the area. So you see, now the Chisiaga has found a conducive environment. Where it can be. Yeah, so about to buy no Kulang, about looking out for so many small little details yeah. of how. What are you yeah. choosing? Actually, for most your... of the kids yeah. adopt things. Be a banga bakula. That is about to be a banga 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 Nakula and Daba Mama Wanga Munyumbanga Mulimua Bantua Babuli Gwanga. So when Nakula, Mama Wanga Yang Yachinji Gizanti, a king to Chikuo Muxa. Katinanga Nino Mana Wangomu, Olava Yaria Wandi Chayagalo Kula by the time he's thirty five. Era to Twacha Unyanaga by Agala Kuzimba orphanage. Katula, which continuing, it's like gen it's passed from generation to generation. So a chin to Chemubera Mugamba, Techikera Kumacha, Nichibera on your Montuali, over to Geze Wabu Sungu, over Tasamu, Sajach Tibo, Chibera Chakula, ecosystem. We call it the ecosystem in gender. I think what you're saying is very, very educative. Mm. In, anyone who's watching should pick up a bit from there. Oh, my old dinner, no more, no laws, and no, I turn this a little charcoal. Ned, yeah. Yeah, Baba Baba Bachi Vakumulandira Foundation. So, um, Kazi Tafuka of Fuse Feminist. Ah, ah. Ah, by Katum Umola was a city of Gorakera Kumacha Navigenda Kutivinagamba. We are not going to allow this allocation of what? Abaya Kula Chakuli Dem. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, Abadi. Mm. But they, but what is your view on feminism? I, I, I want to pick your view. I, I think I want to have a singer, Sagala sounding aunt in Jerese. Bagata. Feminism and empowerment. Yeah. Feminism is just a small component. It's more of rights and space. Rights empowerment and space. is more of a holistic picture. I might actually be empowered in a younger city feminist. Do feminists succeed in marriage? Uh, if you are not careful, no. It's, it's very yeah, because it's always a song about rights. Eh? Yeah, or come your summer, Nana, Nanga, and Sobolo could damn Nana, Abagana, and Gavagamba, and his Zenkan and Kananevsky. So, Omichalo, you know, where Omugaz Gaze, and you never wear a Muyvunga Kulevo Yafe. No, where I'm sending as to know, you know, where Omugaz Gaze or Kumanijing a Igoje to Ioge Deco, no balancing a Biosoma Mobitabo, Bio Wulidango against the Quinternational Conference, Nebia Wasanga O Mobuang. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So Olina ecosystem Let's talk Olina, about that. Oku massaging oku massaging uh, differently. Yeah, it's cool mm. Let's talk about that. Um cause of our man. Mm. Society. Mm. Uh dawate can I submitting a man who's not equal as powerful, but is your husband. Kati e chonjagala kuyam baba sajo rare. Even to every movie ya naturally. Um o moon to bo when you 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 put in, in in consideration, feelings is all Only behavior is eh, eh, natural. Uh, yeah, that's where it all starts. That's where the war starts. So, naturally, abakazi bali emotional. So, emotional confidence, emotional massage, emotional positioning makes a woman uh, submit naturally. And of late, there is a new finding. Nti, Tos omukazi tasola kugana kugondera musajja mulabirira not only emotionally na yene physically. physically yes and remember you people and don't mis misunderstand me it's not the value it's not the the cost of okulabirira no it can be a word actually i i relate to most of the top women in this country na kugamba nze ntambulira uh wali wo buli mukazi kyafumbira ko I actually talked to one of the lawyers, she's called Irene Nangamba. Buli, buli maka, hmm? every unit, nebwebeda muzigo gumu, nebwebeda nyumba ya kari natano. Buli mukazi kunsa inacha afumbira ko. Chovola bango msajja, mkipingi sayo. Yes. Sobo lo kubanga, ntono nyo, o comparing ku the basket of expectation. Na yeno gamba kanyuelele kuchi, yeah. kuchino. Yeah, kati, I will take an example. Waliwo mukazi na gamba kale bawa ngetampa sente 
na ye adeka na asigaza that respect inti omwami akola chi yeah. asuleka ne wabera wa to mulalanga nga akoma three times a week ne those three times a week nga he plays his role as a man yeah. on the needs of the woman and the children and the family so tewali wo single uh, theory or a description of 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 uh, being yeah. submissive yeah. at home yeah. submissiveness is determined by other preconditions yeah. where each of you has to play a role that's yeah. a very beautiful answer by the way. <laughs> i love it yeah. um personal question to you though mm. you've raised very very <laughs> young young men yes of course all your sons and daughters are educated yes they've graduated they are already serving in in this in this nation yes in different you know in different capacities yes how have you been able to to do that still doing what you're doing as an individual kwanga you are in conferences you're speaking in in new end meetings mm. and you're still going to be a mother at home to raise your son or mm. what is it that that brings in that success in both areas still that is a question that most of my friends probably even who will watch this always ask me but as a christian and i and i have to confess this the grace of god plays a very big role yeah because right now one of my children is in london another one is in in canada i don't know but the foundation that yeah. was laid keeps them in check yeah yeah every time i call my son in 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 canada he's listening to you are worthy lord he's listening to gospel, gospel music, music. Yes. however when you when you are in a state like mine the character the availability the commitment of your spouse plays a very big role yeah so and i i, I really i give credit to my husband at this level because when i was in dfc i was literally on the plane you know yeah. but my husband would drop the kids in the morning pick them every day from school he would even go to school without me knowing when they were in ibudo he would do, go every thursday to look at their books to talk to the teachers yeah. so that is why when you distort god wasn't stupid to put father and mother to raise children yeah. because each of you has a role ono baba taliwo ono wali atebwe mubera mwenna it even becomes better so the the success of my children is the grace of god but also the the role that my husband played and me yeah. but also the schools of choice yeah, uh, yeah where we took our children i mean uh, all our children i uh, went to kampala parents and uh, and uh, green hill those schools are had especially green hill it has a foundation of the lord you see yeah. so the earlier these kids get in, uh, that inculcated into them yeah. the better they will be even when yeah. they they grow yeah kati umchara liye yo liye yo ansi aliye kali singa alaba 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 program eno tamanchi dako ngagwa a empowering abakazi omugamba ti what we have into every come denyo abantu um mu buzibo ba mu pain ekisoka abantu amu baba kuza ne baba gamba anti ebyo munju tebi tebi totorwa tebi totorwa yeah so we have a lot of people kati betulabye under the mental health program nga ya sirika na sirikile chintu katinga chabise kubanga omubiri guno gulinga pipe ya mazi you can only pump in a certain quantity bwe gaba yeah. tegaina we gaflumire yabika so we tetwagala abantu babikireyo right now because of the new technology digitalization and eh, one village whatever buli mu tuye na wali obo oli mu katale because there is a program je tukola na abachala ba ba ba, ba kalerwe bawa te wali wo problem ngeri unique to you yeah buli chintu chonna wali wo we chabera walala kugamba te wali chipya muntu kya sobola kola so to sirika nyo funayo abantu babiri basatu ate wali wo abantu amukati katonda bya tu wali wo abasumba bobo bobo amukatuli chi wali wo ba father ba sister at least funayo muntu go goyogera kona ye akuyambe because oyinzo kubera awo you know we are getting a lot of suicide now yeah. i mean last month i talked about it before valentine no kera ku machane weta because you have seen a message in 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 somebody you were just dating 
not even your husband. So, abantu wamu bakopye nye bintu bie chizungu ate ne bachisusa, abalalate, basigali denyo mchintu cha tradition. Na agamba nze chino chene sibieko. Yeah, so, I'm appealing to women out there, banonyobu yambi, evitongo le muevili katibi nji, biakfo divi, ako divi, women in what, you know, na fefe nyini. Uh, uh, to, to to Katrina program, we have Visa Foundation to Jita Ignite. We prepare people, we have training, we have to be able to sustain our businesses. Yeah. Super amazing. I, I, mm. I think a lot of takeaway points today, even for young parents, there are a lot of young couples mm. who are in their 20s, 30s, but I think what would be your best advice? And by the way, you I was, I, was, I, was, I was amazed before we started the show, you were telling me about your age. Yes. And, <laughs> and, and, and I'm, I'm so blessed how you look right now. I mean, what you call out here? Yeah, actually, when Sanga went to Nebagamba and Enda Miakanka, Bekanga, Bamana Kulova, Bazukuru Bangi. We run in a TV show with your Mavi Rambuze. Yeah, yeah, but uh, I want people to learn the habit of reading. Yeah. Right uh, now, while we uh, study Yakolewa in Italy, German, about eight countries, they actually found out that there is a link between happiness, aging, and people who pray a lot and sing. Even when, during COVID, when I got COVID, people would check my lungs, but I would not need oxygen. So they realized that it was more of a behavioral thing. Yeah. I, I would wake up, it's irrespective so of the pain, and raise my hand. So even this act of raising your hand is medicine. And the act of clapping is medicine. Mm. The act of jumping is medicine. So the way you look outside is determined by the way you feel inside. inside. So, so happiness is very key. Yes, and yeah. gratitude. People have to start with being appreciative. Yeah. Even if you, you don't have money, start with the fact that you have both legs and some people don't have. So yeah. my principle is every morning I start with gratitude. I will even touch the bed sheets I've slept in. I'll touch my car. Even when I was coming here, I touched my car and I said, Lord, thank you for such a beautiful car. Wow. So it helps you to start on a positive note. But Chichiko, also Chichiko the Chichiko people around you. Want, want to <laughs> <sanifu>. <laughs> yes. But now, you cut your age by almost 10 years. Neither have a cut such a tone. Yes, I have grandchildren. I have a grandson and a granddaughter. Amazing. Yes. Amazing. But, but we're talking about the young, the young, the young generation. Kati. About the magazine. Now, mm. in, this new, in this new era, mm. the girl is working, the man is working. Mm. Uh, there's a maid at home. They have to raise a, a child. Mm. They have to meet at a certain point. That is one. Secondly, when you see that internet generation, iPad generation, mm. uh, because they have to also do their projects and do other things, how do you, how are you able to balance all this kind of stuff? Kati, ngatuna ba kutuke yo musumba, bobato natuka kubikola na kustem, oso kanotu nuridu mulandira. Kati, ngatuna ba kogera ku generation ye yo miaka vili munana bafumbidwa chenja galabana bafeba manyoru na korwalero totambulira ku social pressure kuwasa kubanga go wasa uwo si wagwanga si wa family obadoga mamu mu miaka ye everything nateli you nateli atabalwa wenyu enedda eche echo kulwawo mwe mwa constructing go mtu okuwasanga ali 31 abata ludeo kubanga it's his individual choice yeah I think that one is okay. 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 I think one is that one is okay. I think that yeah. Na yechi diche tuwa gambi enti ya kuzibu hatia. Ecosystem. Adiration mm. ya, 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 ya building hatia. Family ye mumutwegwe. Yeah. Because what you build here has to come to live and be seen. Yeah. Yeah. Kati. Ichisokela uh, 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 da abantu bena kuzino chamber kubiliza. Abantu badeo kuzili basic seza pride. You know. Fetuwa kuzibu wangawaluwe bintu. Biyo manjibi otosobola kola. You know you shouldn't be seen. 
uh, enaku zonda baba na bawala abalu unji baso mamu S2, S3 apisa mabele literally otambula ngo ngolibwe lele so ebyo nawe bitandikira kubanga quality era jono pulinga era yeyo eline ndoze yo so mwenane mubera wakamugendo kuza abana nenga mwenana muline ebintu bye bimu bye mulowoza anti babiyita kubera kunobwe nti this is what is marketable so yeah so abana bafe bakopye nyo ebintu na na vajavu denalo zanti ajja kire touch simbe wano mm -hmm. kati abasinga basanzo obuzibu yeah. e najja kutukulima ebituli bibiri mulenzi kati already one of face society ya fe eline ebintu byeraba ne ne kusalira omusango atolu mungu omusango go simutufu mm -hmm. yeah kati nganze one of my best doctors when i was at school in south africa yalina dreads but he's even the one who you know who treated me for all the five years I was in South Africa. Do you get? Yeah. So in their culture, it was okay. It's okay. <clears throat> and what I want to tell the youth today, before you copy certain things, what do environment and that you know so cool or accepted. Exactly. Or they make a judge. Yeah. Yeah. So unze kati nina mwala wange doctor. Kati nembera e kanande tiro msajja nga asibye ze mvili na bichi oro atenga nze ndi exposed in tambula ndabi ebintu yeah i mean i've been to the world economic summit where the chief presenter has dreads and has pins and you know na yenga kwa ya i was struggling yes in struggling na bwa bwa tandi ko kuogera no love magezi so no realizing anti envy ne pini ne bwa yamba de has nothing to do with the brain na ye ebyo it has to be a process tugenda to same vula mpola mpola the culture around you must be able to accept it yes. understand it yeah, yeah. The, the whole ecosystem not yeah. only culture yeah. kawabe kawabe just i've been to countries uh, in in scandinavia where abantu ese bagge baina pub za wezo ka yeah. wogenda ngo oli mukazi nenga gwe we convincing anti oli musajja you see ne wano tezili so what we have been to be no kusoko kuba in place before you copy certain things no be later mugwanga yeah. jova yeah. yes yeah. so uh, about raising children and balancing them so abantu bale mukwera obezi ku, ku social media mm -mm. bakope bintu ebili mutano mutano novela mm. e, kwanga bakazi bale banyobo za nyobo eh. makoleya <laughs> Na you want to be no kuchuka my environment here. Salvador. And and I think for someone who's watching uh, <laughs> and they're a bit younger and they're being mentored by social media. Mm. Right now, by the it is it is mentoring people like a TikTok, mm. a, a short video of one minute can mentor someone's mind decision, di direction, mm. choices and way of life. Actually, yeah. people have to remember also until we've been to Babi Zanya Buzany. Chuburanga Bazany yeah. never go mutunga food and yenga mula masa. Yeah. So leave alone the, the, the fact in the environment here yeah, we are yeah, creating a bean to where they feed. Yeah. Tebidi yo. Yes yeah, so, so it's so it's not real. It's, and it's, it's not, not a real, real world. No, it's not a real world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It doesn't exist. Those were kubera na muntunga akole ebi bintu bi bakola tebili yo babizanya buzanya oyo oyo mutali yo eh oyo mutali yo bakola mukole okuzanyira kubwongo bwabantu aina director aina camera aina mm. editor eh otali yo chovola walwo mchalo mugwe na sinkana nga yagala kuduka she had a very good job in the bank nenga yagala kuduka nentula na ye for over 4 hours sikera bila ku serena ne mu bintu byo nabyo 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 yangamba yali ya creating a man Nayenga that man doesn't exist and can never exist in any man in Africa. Ngayagalo om sajja amweleza message ah ebo mirundi esatu olunako bilibye balaba. Yeah. Yeah. Nay also katula bye nyone ngabaganda baga mambulira go yitana ye. Ereche chimu kuchenja galo okogera. Nti abazungu bagamba anti bad company corrupts and it corrupts absolutely. What they mean? Bobera no muntu nga ina eneyi semu Changu nyo na wajiga no kuchusa value zizo. Gwabada agamba nti ni no kudaye kakusawa by sawa satu. Eh? Ogendo kula bango na dayo muna ananga gamba. Ah, nene na okirizo mkazo kufugo. Manyi mwa wasaba kaza abaso ma. Yeah. Fe wano tubela ne wano paka kumacha. You see, ogendo kula banga atani so kujenya etano. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Tuwa kuzibu wanga tumanyinti dadi ya deka na alia na abana. 
kati bwabera ne company mmunge mugamba ah you don't have to eat osobola kufuna wane chigere no uta aje chimanyira this is so ebibyo nabyo nabyo nakati be playing the role uh mukuchusa the way people position yeah. family Asajia and Magana values and the role yeah. aha uh -huh. asaje yeah. abana abasoka tabakola bwe bati bintu we bichu yes yeah yeah we, which cannot su uh, thrive anymore yeah. and people have to remember and your character or behavior or your decisions zili no putting any to consideration chikacha mukazi chigwe wa wasa kati oli ayinzo kubanga achikola kubanga ina illiterate uh, uh, woman who is not economically empowered who has no access to kati gwe no chigeza keno yes era turabye nyo e kati actually right now we are struggling with that yeah. oli aku influencing no copa Eh, Oli omukazi nga ye yakuzibwa nga byagalo kopa ono mulala eno bikola eno byabya yeah. <laughs> and, and, and I honestly think that a lot of marriages I think people have to know that that marriage is unique mm. because of the people that are involved in it yes to sort of kopa systems kuva walala mm. ziba unique oro muntu oyo ali ali involved uh, partner yeah, yeah. I, 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 as your faith in god mm play the role in who you are right now of course my faith my exposure my friends but also pastors yeah. yes kubanga era ngo muntu yenna wali wo tukekisira no zitowelerwa nebo gende wa pastor nayo gera kona wacho bula banga abantu bafe bagude daluka tne bakola chi kubanga balooza anti olino okukweka but okusoma bible chi kuyamba reading normal reading no manya statistics and what is going on but also having people that can help you. And I thank you so much, Mr. and Mrs. Navudere, Mchara Sechide. So they help you to bring you together. And also what people have to know, at every different stage or age, women look at things differently. Yeah. Things that used to hurt me when I was 28 don't hurt me now because my priorities are have different. changed. That's right. right now, my success is measured by the ability to make certain decisions on my own, yeah. the fact that I can have cash available, but most importantly, what each of my children have become. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. But there is a time I would measure my success based on how many hours I will spend with my husband, and that would measure my happiness. Yeah. But that is not the case. So Quality let time. women listening out there yeah. be patient and hang in there and know that as you grow, priorities change and areas of focus. <laughs> I, 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 I guess this has been a mighty empowerment for women. You've done, you've, you've done, I mean, you've done so well in terms, in terms of being able to listen to myself. I think that was a very, very, very good information. Mm -hmm. I, I pick up so many points that I think must be discussed on and on, mm -hmm. even, even in the coming future. Okay. But also, I think we don't take time to understand people yeah. that we are living with. Yeah. Those, I think for mm. me that has been a, a very big you know, mm. bigger point. But also, that then brings us to, to the point. If we know that, that how we, we, we were brought up affects who we are now, mm. that means we, we must be intentional Yes. on how we are raising our children. Yes. And, wh and what are some of those things in a minute that you think must be key as you raise boys? You, I mean, you have boys and girls. Mm. Because I have you're, one girl. <laughs> you're raising one some biological girl, but I have so many children. Okay. Mm. Because you're raising someone's wife. Yes. And you're raising someone's husband. Yes. What are those intentional things that you're doing as a mother? Yeah, what people have to understand, you can do so much as a parent. Yeah. Bottom line is the inner person of your child you can't see. But there are little things you can do to help that inner person. Yeah who can only be controlled by the Lord and the person carrying that person. Mm. Uh, for instance, one of the things that I, I, we have done is to make sure that our daughter is emotionally stable, mm. secure. You know, people you underestimate the importance of feeling secure as you are growing up. There are certain things that must be in place for a child to feel that, you know, uh, I'm catered for, I'm loved, yeah. I'm provided for, so that kids don't start early to struggle to survive. Yeah. Somebody at seven years. There is another school of thought, especially from a certain background, 
people who think that a, a boy should start hustling hey, uh, from as early. But <laughs> it, the world, <laughs> this is the hey. 21st century, and there are some things that we are struggling with um, to try uh, and redirect. Yeah. Yeah. So, Abana Katia Bena Kuzunobaina environment, Yavaino Kuberam, Okula, Neva Manyanti, Omutwaina rights, Naye Omutwaina obligation, Katia Bantu, Buffeting Okumaringa, the two. If you're expecting certain rights, also know your obligation as a person. Yes. Yes. So with every right comes responsibility. Yes. And I think you have to know the difference. Yes. You have a right to use a road, mm. but you cannot keep right if it's meant to be left. Yes. So that is your obligation. That's where now we have gone wrong. Yes. You have a job, you have a job description. You only see it when you are signing it. You only remember it at the appraisal. I'm yeah. working with one of the biggest parastators. We actually found out that in one of the offices where they have eight people, they, have, they need one. So yeah. that is a loss to government. Yeah. You are paying eight people, but the output... You can't define even what you come to do. Even yeah. if you have to do accountability yeah, yeah. of your space, mm. accountability why you're earning salary, accountability yeah. why you wake up every morning and go to work. So this country and the world, especially now Uganda, we have a lot of work to do in changing the mentality of some people. It's not just about waking up and you appear at work. Yeah. You have to have the consciousness to appraise, self-appraise on a daily, hourly to say, am I worth to be paid? Yeah. Am I still <clears throat> relevant here? Without even other forces eh? or, or management being around you. Yeah. So all those are things that you have to inculcate in children. Yes, and people who know my son, at KC, they know. Everybody keeps telling me, how did you raise him? How come that he's so responsible? How come that he, he's accountable for his time, for his you know, contribution? So... Uh, the, the, environment. the environment, environment and the, the conversation, yeah. the intentional direction is very, very important. Muruganda Tugamba, Guetoko, Wako, Geda, Gueyo Geda, but and Koku to Mamania. I remember when I was, uh, I was growing up on the Muzei Wangaba Muita Moi, Arab Moi, because yeah. he would come with a stick, you see. But as I grew, <laughs> I realized, oh, so those nicknames were not necessary. He was just doing his job. Yeah. So, but making sure they are ready to be parents. Mm. If that's not wisdom, I don't know how to describe it. <laughs> Thank you so much. Those who are joining us on Rest TV this month is dedicated to women. We want to celebrate mothers, our friends, wives, spouses, and just the woman in general. Mm. Women at every age, women at every level. We honor women <coughs> in this nation. Rest TV believes in the hardworking woman, and uh, we, we are going to be bringing for you uh, lots of women in the coming days, the coming months, to speak to us. We are, we've been privileged today to have with us Dr. Teo, with her experience shared with us, and it's been an amazing thing. So many things to take home today, real practical things to change the story of, of your family. God bless you, and until next time, happy Women's Day. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Bye.